my boyfriend really made me upset and i feel like the situation could have been handled a little bit better but since guys this is told us like since we are at a point where we are no longer talking to each other because of this how can we come out stronger and she's just a girl and she's on fire hi guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi babes i hope you will enjoy this video and you'll subscribe and join our gang gang family and if you're a returning subscriber welcome back Ndombazan. welcome back gang gang <laughs> So guys, the first thing or the one thing I want you to take from this video is you need to invest in yourself. I'm on a journey of investing in myself and I'm going to break it down into six things or points that I'm trying to do in order for me to invest in myself. There's so much you can do, but I'm just going to share six things that I feel personally are working for me or I feel that I need in order for me to actually see or in order for me to actually invest in myself. So the first thing that I'm going to share with you guys or the first thing that I've been doing um, in order for me to actually invest in myself is to know who I am. I believe that before you know what to do or before you know your purpose, you need to know who you are because who you are will determine what you do. Do you understand? Guys, if I could ask you who you are outside of what you do, I, I honestly believe 90% of the people watching this video won't be able to answer my question. Like, I know that I am a full time master's student, right? I am a daughter of someone. I am a sister to someone, I am a content creator, I am whoever, but who am I as we learn data outside of the things that I'm doing? Who am I as a person? So that's the first thing that I've been trying to remind myself that I am called for greatness. Who does my father say I am? Because first things more than anything, I'm a child of God and who does my father say I am? Because at the end of the day, he does say, Oguti, I am co as with Christ. What does that mean for me? Okay, so the first thing that I've been trying to do to discover who I am is something that I really dislike. And I cannot believe that I'm actually saying this and I'm actually enjoying it now is being by myself. I'm one person who likes being around people because I just don't like to hear my thoughts. My brain never rests, guys. It's always thinking and I'm the most paranoid person ever because of my brain but I've been trying to spend more time alone so that I can be as truthful and honest as possible with myself because you know when you are always around people your thoughts are always confused or clouded or you never think straight because every decision you take is influenced by whoever's around you or is influenced by whatever situation or circumstance that you are currently in at that particular moment. So what I've been doing is I've been spending more time alone, not even the whole day because it's something that I really struggle with. So I've decided to at least spend an hour or two hours of the day by myself whether i go on a solo date which is really 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 awkward i won't lie to you but it works when you go on a solo date take your journal i have my journal with me over here take your journal and take your pen go out on a breakfast date or whatever date that you enjoy i i love i love 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 breakfast dates so that for me has been really easy because I'll just go to Spur or Wimpy, order myself some breakfast, coffee or cappuccino or whatever. Also, coffee is not working for me. Okay, but I'm going to get to that right now. So, I'll go on a solid day, take my journal and just write how I'm feeling and be as honest as possible. If I'm feeling happy, why am I feeling happy? If I'm feeling sad, why am I feeling sad? How can I improve my feelings? How can I make sure that at the end of the day I'm feeling much better than how I'm feeling? Or if I'm really feeling happy, then who am I supposed to thank? Because it's really important for you to tell people that you appreciate them and all of that. And sometimes it's really hard to let people know that you appreciate them or to show that you appreciate them if you are always around them. Because 
you tend to think what they are supposed to be doing that or they're supposed to be acting a certain way and you know no one is forced to be kind to you no one is forced to be nice to you so it's really nice to take a step back and be like actually today i'm happy because of oh anela let me call her and say yazi yesterday was nice i really enjoyed it and i really appreciate having you in my life please don't ever get tired of me i love you and i love what you do for me and i love the person that i am around you or if you are sad okay but I put it, okay my boyfriend really made me upset and i feel like the situation could have been handled a little bit better but since since we are at a point where we are no longer talking to each other because of this how can we come out stronger and how can i make the situation better and sometimes i even find out with i'm actually upset for something so petty that it's not like there's no need for this drama you know and I end up calling him and be like you know what i'm really sorry that i just got upset and i didn't give you a chance to explain your point sorry or to like express yourself because sometimes as women guys we can be crazy <laughs> and you won't be able to see that you're crazy in the moment but when you are when you're reflecting yes that's my point being by yourself helps you reflect on a lot of things which will improve you or will make you become a better person so that's the first thing i've been spending a lot of time by myself that has been helping me think clearly without confusing my emotions or including my emotions in my decisions and it's been helping me become really productive because sometimes you know very well that you're supposed to get one two and three done but you get one done and then you go chill with your friends and for you to go back home and get one two and three done so i've been trying to make sure that if i go chill with my friends or if i start watching a certain youtube video it's because really i'm done with whatever that i was supposed to do so being by myself really helps me become productive and i love that and most importantly when i'm by myself i have more time alone with god i don't know if i need to repeat that but when i'm by myself I have more time to fellowship with the Holy Spirit that lives inside of me. So the second thing I've been doing is writing down my dreams. <sighs> so each and every person guys own a vision or own a idea of who they want to become or what they would like to achieve. For me, it's more of who I would like to become. I am one person who believes Uguti. I, Londe Gamkize, am a brand. I am a brand as Londe Gamkize. So how can I make myself better? How can I improve who I am, basically? So I've been writing my dreams down and I've been writing my goals because you have a dream, you have a goal, then you have short and long-term goals and then you have other activities that you need to do every day in order for you to achieve the short-term goal or the long-term goal or you after you do those short-term goals nine, 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 they play a big role in you achieving that big dream and doing that helped me so much in terms of within given a vision and have direction because now i have i'm a to-do list that i do every day that helps me achieve that certain goal or that helps me achieve that short-term or long-term goal that i need to accomplish in order for me to finally or one day reach that big dream that i have of who i want to be for example i want to create a world for women where they can be loved and appreciated and just shown how important they are i just want to create power and beauty and all of that and I cannot just wake up saying the powerhouse of white doors, one don't 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 saying oh, Oprah Winfrey or whoever. I need to start knowing what okay, this is my first step because it's a ladder. So this if I do this today, this will be one step closer to achieving that big dream that I have that will one day come to life. But I have to make sure with the I water 
that tree that's a one to make uh, there's a one to make big one day i have to water it every day as a seedling and see it grow each and every day so writing my goals down having that vision board doing that to-do list will help you have a clear vision of what your life can be or what you want your life to be so that you have clear understanding on what to do every single day so the next thing i've been doing is writing down everything that i like and everything that i dislike i promise you this will change your life because you'll have a better understanding of what to do and what not to do for example i i dislike looking like i'm not put together I, I, that's not proper english but i dislike being a mess it's it ruins my day when i don't look the part i get so discouraged i get yo guys I, I don't even know how to describe it but i really don't like looking like a mess or i don't like when i don't have things put together or when i don't have things organized for example my outer appearance plays a big role in my confidence if i look good i feel good and most of the time I am as I don't know to but I just look like I I I'm homeless and I expect to be productive and I expect to feel good about myself when I know very well we see when I don't look good I don't feel good so that's one of the things that I've made number one on my list I need to look good all the time in order for me to feel good i need to look good and i know this but i continue to do it over and over again and i think i'm gonna feel good at the end of the day which is just self-sabotage so i've written a long list of everything that i don't like about myself or that i don't like jay in general and another thing i don't like coffee Besides the fact that it makes me sick, I actually don't like the taste of coffee, but I continue to buy coffee because I want to take nice pictures for Instagram. I want to post on my stories. It's a solid day. Cappuccino. Mocha. Cafe Latte. When I taste it, I'm like, why did I do this to myself again? Because it tastes so bitter in my mouth. I do not like it at all. But I continue to do it over and over again. But now, I've been trying to do what makes me happy. I love coke so much and I know it's not good for me but I enjoy it and it makes me happy so I've been drinking a lot of coke which I need to stop but I won't lie as you can see the smile on my face coke makes me happy so I've been drinking more coke than coffee even on my breakfast dates because that makes me happy and after that date I'm more productive because I had a good start to my day I love being with my friends like I really love being with my friends it makes me really happy and I've been doing a lot of that I love receiving phone calls from my mom and whenever I don't receive a phone call from my mom my dad doesn't really go that well so I always make sure that each and every day I speak to mom because I know after that phone call I'll be feeling great I'll be feeling more energized I'll be feeling more productive and Evangel ready to get everything and you know secure the bag <laughs> so making a list of everything that you like and everything that you don't like helps you so much in discovering who you are because like I said before most of the decisions we take we take are based or influenced by the people around us and if for those are honest do what mean as Ozana and I actually do not like an iPhone so there's no need for me to pressure myself into buying the new um iPhone 13 Pro Max because at the end of the day I don't even like the brand I don't mind carrying my Android so why am I wasting money why am I pleasing people when I'm just supposed to be you know buying that affordable phone and being happy rather than putting myself as well as in your tank Pro Max a greeny giving us guys you would say I don't even like this thing to begin with so if you won't be honest 
this will not help you making this list will not help you and after making the list if you are not honest with yourself and if you are not like if you do not keep yourself accountable Uguti, i do not like one two and three so let me stop doing one two and three in order for me to actually feel good about myself in order for me to actually be more happy then making the list will be pointless you need to be honest with yourself and you need to be consistent Make sure that whatever I panel you would say I do not like it, you actually don't do it. Whatever I panel you would I actually like this. Do more of that in order for you to be more happy. It's been working for me. Some of the things are not easy, but I'm really trying every day to actually do what I have written down. So the last thing I want to share on this video that I've been trying to implement in my life is knowing Guguti. I'm going to try and translate it now on the screen in English but I, it just makes sense to me in Zulu. If you cannot treat other people right trust me you won't go anywhere in life you'll be miserable because no one will want to be around you no one will want to help guys no one will want to help around that person so you need people to move from a to b you need people to build whatever empire or whatever legacy you are trying to build. You will not build it by yourself unless you want to be miserable, unless you want to work until you pumulage ekebole tu no ma lab angaz e minyam gawes e minyam dal. Oh, unless you funi pumulen do do so, yabo. H o ko nang sabas so. Some of the things I've been trying to learn is how to strengthen my um, team playing skills, how to work with others well, how to be a team player for the A team obviously and just knowing that you need to create connections in life in general. You need to create co connections whether you are a 9 to 5 babe or you are in content creation you need to know people who know people that's the honest truth like we were not meant to have our own islands you know we were we were created on this earth to live together because we need one another that's the honest truth and if you want to go big you need to make sure that you are able to connect to people you are able to be a good team player you are a loyal person you are smart and you just know Uguti, when something doesn't serve you anymore walk away and also be the person who's able to bring people together and actually make a healthy environment that's one thing i've been trying to learn and it's really challenging but i'm up for the challenge i i really love that because it's making me a leader it's making me a boss babe it's making me an alpha female it's making me everything that i want to be just being able to bring people together being able to make sure that the environment is not toxic being able to make sure that each person lives feeling greater or feeling um feeling good about themselves is so satisfying it's so rewarding at the end and I don't think there's anything you want to more than a person who people can count on than being a person who people can count on it's it's the greatest feeling ever and I want to feel that more often so I'm really challenging myself to know with him we need people in order for us to succeed we need people in order for us to be happy we need people in order for us to move from that small short-term goal to that big dream of being a powerful um boss babe who one day create a world where women can be celebrated where women can be acknowledged where women can be appreciated okay so i hope that you guys learned something from this video next week i'm going to be sharing everything that i've noticed which i've been doing wrong for the past 25 years of my life anyways thank you so much guys i hope that you enjoyed this video and i hope to see you guys in the comment section
and then I learned that so pendula na corner guys please 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 I love and appreciate you guys until next time bye